Mirror mirror on the wall, who is the fittest of them all? This time, it will actually be able to give you an answer. Portal, a Hyderabad-based fit tech firm has developed a magic mirror, or rather a smart mirror that is life-sized, interactive and is completely personalized. So Portal is your life-sized interactive fitness mirror that's actually a smart home gym with an inbuilt personal trainer. So what happens on our device is every user receives highly personalized workouts and fitness and wellness solutions that account for their health conditions, their underlying injuries or you know aches and pains and makes routines on a daily basis that's suited just for that person. There are ways on how we do that, right? So initially, we look at uh, your entire health vitals across your ECG, your blood pressure, your glucose, and a few other metrics that are tracked by the device. Basis of that, we know what should not be prescribed to you as well. Then you undergo a fitness assessment on our platform. So this fitness assessment is actually something that helps us determine your current physical capabilities and limitations as well. Founded in late 2020 by Indranil Gupta, Vishal Chandapeta and Arman Kandhari, the mirror takes a fitness assessment of every user and they get a personalized fitness program. Now one of the coolest aspects of this entire workout experience that's personalized for you is it also detects your posture in real time and corrects it if you're doing something wrong. We have over 600 plus movements that are supported on our platform across 16 different workout categories. The idea over here is we want to keep fitness and wellness very entertaining and also engaging for people at home without making them feel bored with doing the same squats and push-ups. So we have a very, very wide uh, library of you know, workout formats. Of course, you have your HIIT, your cardio, but we also have skill builders like karate. You can learn self-defense at home with Muay Thai. All of these instructors are going to be leading you on technique, form, how to throw a punch. But at the same time, we also have different things like yoga and meditation, pain management, uh, along with uh, mobility. We have different forms of dance fitness on the platform as well as your body weight and strength and conditioning routines. One of the pain points in the fitness industry has been personalization as people often have not enjoyed the gym experience or could not find the right trainer. Working on this, Portal wants to solve the issues of personalization, convenience and time flexibility. You've heard this story very common, right? I've tried, I've gone to the gym, it hasn't worked out. I've gone to another place, it stopped working then. Right? There's a reason for that, right? Uh, number one is you may not have found the right trainer who understands you, your requirements and gives you suggestions based on that. A lot of people also don't have the time to dedicate on a daily basis or on a frequent basis. right? And not everyone wants to do the similar type of workout either. right? So to solve for these pain points, which is personalization, convenience and time flexibility, we, want, we, we thought of doing something where everyone in a household will have access to something on demand which is also personalized, which is also going to give you that same personalized attention without really breaking the bank. So the live class segment allows you to interact not just with our trainers, but also with other portal community members in real time. So now you are engaging with them. It's a highly social feature. So that's how everything happens. The mirror is embedded with biosensors, HD cameras, and HAI processing with Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. So uh, the system is uh, embedded with a lot of sensors. Right, so that is actually uh, that actually allows us to do all the processing on device itself. So we've also built for those use cases where um, not every home may have an active, stable internet connection all the time. So you should still be able to derive value out of it. So a lot of uh, the core tech is towards doing edge processing on the device. Right, uh, we have uh, high fidelity sensors here that uh, detect your form and posture. We reconstruct all of this in 3D on the back end in real time. Uh, so a lot of those tech aspects are part of the entire offering. Um, from a hardware level, yes, it's uh, five. It's about five, eight, five feet eight inches by two feet. That just takes up that much space on your wall. Um, and um, yeah, that's that's about it. While Portal might be India's first company to bring a smart fitness mirror, one can easily draw parallels with Peloton's mirror, which was launched in 2018. What you see in the US, uh, like you have Peloton and Mirror, which are, which are so Peloton even got listed, uh, listed on the market, which is a uh, technology driven uh, cycling machine. Now they also have the treadmills and they also have a 
device which which guides you to do your own workout but when it comes to the indian market these equipments still have a uh, i would say a uh, very low penetration uh, when it comes to the market if you look at the use case what mirror uh, or peloton puts for the audience in the us market i think their uh, their usp is like is is made for a family so anybody in the family uh, they can use it Uh, and the second thing is at your own convenience so uh, keeping our busy schedule lifestyle at any point of time whenever you are free you can use these equipment so uh, obviously uh, the kind of lifestyle people have people are getting busier day by day and also the disposable income of people is slowly increasing so definitely uh, for a period of time these devices are going to find many homes where people are going to get it uh, set up as the pandemic accelerated the adoption of technology in every segment fitness was in left behind technology was there i mean in the fitness space but we we had a force adoption i would say in 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 the different phases of lockdown that we had when we really didn't have choices to go to the gyms or the fitness studios and we were all uh, inside our houses so we really didn't have didn't have choice so people were forced to try the different uh, options available online where they can explore these uh, uh, online platforms and try them from artificial intelligence to metaverse fitness is getting smarter by every move